If you're looking for free music software to start making beats or producing your own music, this video is going to cover two DAWs or digital audio workstations for you to start making beats or recording your own music without spending a penny. Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jay Ezra and I cover photography, videography, music, and music recording. If you like the video, please like and subscribe so you don't miss any videos in the future. If you like the video, please press like and subscribe so you don't miss any future videos. I release a new video every single week. Now, when I first wanted to start recording music, I had no direction, I had no clue what to do. I didn't know that you needed a DAW to record your music through. And I have a couple of friends who use really cheap and unprofessional recording software that you can find on the internet. And I want to stay away from those kinds of software. The Two DAWs that I'm going to be talking about are Pro Tools First and FL Studio. I've been using Pro Tools for about five years now and I absolutely love it. Pro Tools is also the industry standard in music recording, so if you end up going to college, you'll most likely learn how to record music using Pro Tools. Now the full version of Pro Tools is a couple hundred dollars, but they do offer a free version called Pro Tools First. This free version has everything you need to record your music or even start making beats as well. Now the only downside with using Pro Tools first is that it doesn't come with all the plugins that the full version has and you can only save three songs on it. If you want to add another song you'd have to delete one of the songs in order to make a new composition. There are more differences between the full version and the demo version of Pro Tools but those are the two big differences that matter to me the most. There's a big learning curve to using Pro Tools but there are thousands of videos on YouTube to show you how to do it. Um, so I recommend watching as many of them as you can and supporting as many other YouTubers as you can too. Now the second DAW I want to talk about is FL Studio. If you're looking to make beats, FL Studio is probably the most popular DAW to use for this. The full producer version will cost you about $200, but FL Studio offers a full trial version of their software for absolutely free, so you can start making your own beats without spending anything at all. When you download the trial version of FL Studio, you have access to all their sounds and all their plugins. Now, the only downside is that you can't save any of the songs, but you can download them to your computer. So you can make a song and then download it, but as soon as you click out, it deletes the entire song and you have to start over. So all you have to do is basically make the song, download it to your computer, and then start a new song as soon as you're done. Another great thing about FL Studio is that once you're ready for it, FL Studio is only $200, so it will only take you a little bit of time to save up for that. Once you're ready to upgrade, FL Studio is also less expensive than Pro Tools costing roughly a few hundred dollars less than Pro Tools. I suggest downloading both and seeing which one you like the most because at the end of the day, it all boils down to personal preference. Some people will say they like Pro Tools more, some people will say they like FL Studio more. Like I said, it's all about personal preference. I like both of them. If you're watching this and you're trying to decide between the two, here's a good rule of thumb. If you want to record music, then I would go for Pro Tools. And if you want to make beats, then I would go for FL Studio. Both DAWs can record music and both DAWs have the ability to make beats. So like I said, it all boils down to personal preference and what feels the best for you. There are a lot of other DAWs out there that are amazing like GarageBand, Logic, Reason, Cubase, but Pro Tools First and the demo version of FL Studio are one of my personal favorites, so that's why they're on this list. So guys, don't waste your time using cheap and unprofessional software that's out there on the internet um, when there are DAWs like Pro Tools First and FL Studio that will give you amazing and professional results. Now this is the end of the video, so I hope this helps you decide what kind of DAW you want to use. And I hope this gets you on the path to start making your own music and your own beats. If you have any questions, please write them down in the comments and I'll respond to them as soon as I can. Also, stick around for more videos in the future. This is Jay Ezra, and like I always say, be kind, be happy, and peace out.